this will be an unboxing of the TP-Link TL-WN881ND. So basically it's a 300 megabit per second wireless and PCI Express X1 adapter with uh, supposedly high, excellent high speed, advanced security uh, for your WPA encryption, and it's supposedly very easy to use with three year warranty and 24-7 technical support. It is Windows 8 compatible, uh, up to 300 megabit per second on the 2.4 gigahertz frequency, and it's Wi-Fi certified. Inside here we can see a bunch of barcodes. On the top here we can see a TP-Link logo and green. And then on the back here we've got a bit more of a breakdown of what this particular device has support for. So they're showing related products, uh, so you can use your wireless N, uh, 300 megabit per second router, and then you can connect uh, put it by putting this card in your desktop, etc. There's an installation disk, installs the drivers, and connect to the web, and all sorts of things. 300 megabit per second wireless data rates ideal for HD video streaming, online gaming, and internet call. PCI Express 2.0 interface fits any standard PCI Express X1, X4, X8, or X16 slot. WPA, WPA2, WPA, PSK, WPA2, PSK encryption, so the really good encryptions. Uh, allows you to secure your network and actively defense, uh, defend against uh, security threats. Uh, bundled utility name is very easy management. Backwards compatible with 802.11 BNG uh, products. So if you do have a wireless G router, this will be fully compatible. Detachable antennas allow for stronger antenna upgrades. And then we've got multilingual features. That's pretty much it. So if you open the box, get my handy dandy scissors, cut the cling wrap sort of packaging here. And then we open up the box with a nice sort of QR code. Let's see if I can read this one. If you, if you can be bothered, try and scan that. No idea what it says. It probably takes you to their website. So if we open it up, we get the box out of the other box. Throw that away. And then we open this up. We find a mini disc for the installation. Don't need it. They will probably auto-install with any uh, modern operating system. If not, you can just go to their website and download the absolute latest. This how to bloody well install the thing. Again, showing XP, so that's probably why there's a drive disk. Because XP doesn't have full support for downloading from the internet natively. Bit of a warranty, whoop de da There's a uh, smaller expansion slot bracket, so if you do have a low-profile um, expansion slot case, so most um, pre-built OEM PCs that are of a small form factor will have PCI expansion slots that are uh, the smaller form factor. So you can put that on that if you don't if you don't have full support for uh, the long bracket. We've got the antennas, pretty standard fare, and then we've got the car itself and an anti-static bag. Remember to ground yourself before handling any electrostatic sensitive devices. We can see there's the chip there. PCI Express X1 interface, which will go into PCI expansion slot, basic fare, you screw in the antennas there, and then you can use a screwdriver for there and there to unscrew it and then put on the smaller bracket. 300 megabit per second, uh, pretty decent. This is a sub $20 uh, wireless card, so if you do need basic wireless connectivity um, and power line, Ethernet, or uh, running an actual Cable is not really an option. This is probably uh, a pretty decent bet, but I always say to people I know uh, that you should avoid Wi-Fi as much as possible because five years ago Wi-Fi was pretty good, um, but now that most people have uh, you know mobile phones, smartphones with Wi-Fi connectivity and tablets and laptops and ultrabooks and everything, the Wi-Fi spectrum tends to get a bit oversaturated. So if you are wanting to uh, play games or have any sort of consistent low latency uh, internet connection, you probably want to look at uh, power line ethernet adapters um, or actually running a cable because Wi-Fi uh, these days tends to have a bit of latency and a bit of interference generally from your neighbours. So do keep that in mind. Thanks for watching the unboxing of the TP-Link TL-WN881ND 300 megabit per second wireless adapter.